Hey, this is Judge bringing you some advanced warfare. I've got a sick UAV montage on deck for you. Yes, UAV montage, because that is about the only thing I can consistently pull out in this game as of right now. But don't want to talk about that. Instead, I want to talk about revenge spawns. Did you see where that guy spawned? He actually spawned right in my line of sight, didn't have a chance. Now, with the revenge spawn system, you guys know ever since Modern Warfare 3, or in Modern Warfare 3, they introduced the revenge spawn spawn system and my man creamy was actually talking about this if you haven't checked out creamy's channel put a link right here the dude is hilarious make sure if you go to his channel you check out when he drank the milk and check this out all right i just died i'm gonna spawn here in a second and look at that i am right in the line of sight of that person right there and i did not have any chance all right so that's the revenge spawn system and that actually wasn't the guy who killed me but i spawned near the guy who killed me and unfortunately it was near an enemy right there and i didn't have a chance and there's another time i spawned there's a guy actually looking right at me and ends up taking me out but back to my man creamy he did the milk challenge where you chug a gallon of whole milk and he ended up just spewing it, I mean literally spewing it out all over, it was hilarious. He also tried waxing his beard, and, you know, I had fun watching him do that. And here's another time where I spawned right in front of somebody looking at me. But, you know, dude has a lot of funny things on his channel, but he's also a beastly Call of Duty player. So if you like that type of gameplay, he's been featured on Thunderstruck, make sure you check out his channel. I'll have a link in the video description and also right here on the screen. But he's the one who is actually talking about MW3 actually starting the revenge spawn system and I don't know if I've explained that but it's basically if you get killed you're gonna actually spawn near the person that killed you you know so that you can get revenge on that person now sometimes you know it works out well you know if you're the one doing the killing because people will spawn in front of you and you can just keep on mowing them down sometimes it doesn't work out so well because they'll literally spawn behind you or they'll spawn in front of you and they'll know the path that you're taking so they can just sit there and wait for you and just end up taking you out so um, it got me thinking though because like he pointed out it you know started in MW3 and I actually enjoyed MW3 I don't know I think I'm like one of the weird people that actually enjoyed that game if I went back and tried to play it now uh, I think I would think it was super slow but I think that had something to do with the revenge spawn system kind of working you know the pace of the game was a little bit slower so it was a little bit easier to manage in advanced warfare this game is just so fast you know a lot of times you know you see these people flying around your screen and I'm not sure if they're friends or foes and sometimes I don't shoot at them because I'm playing hardcore and they end up killing me I'm like oh that was an enemy so you know the pace being so fast uh, with this revenge spawn system makes it a little bit difficult to handle Plus, you actually have to look up, look all around, make sure you're watching your six, make sure you're watching, you know, up above, down below. There's so many things to keep track of. It's hard to, you know, find people, and I think you're a bit you're at a little bit of a disadvantage when it comes to enemies spawning near you and knowing where you're at and which way you're going and everything like that but um, you know that's one thing that I would love to see change in this game I'd like to see them go away from this revenge spawn system I think they did it because the pace of ghosts was so slow you know they thought hey we need to make this game fast paced we're gonna have the movement going crazy let's give them revenge spawn systems there won't be an idle time there won't be a time where you know you're wishing something was is going to be going on because it's just going to be frantic and crazy and I think that's what they were going for which I can appreciate but I think it needs to be scaled back you know especially please don't spawn me looking at somebody don't spawn me you know uh, just ready to die and everything like that especially when it comes to hardcore you don't have a chance when you spawn in front of somebody and you really don't have a chance in court because of the time to kill being so low in this game and I don't even see how that guy saw me to take me out right there I don't know but there's some other things that I'd like to see changed, but I didn't really talk about the spawn system in my last video when I was doing my review, so I wanted to cover it in this one. Let me know what you guys think, though. Do you like the revenge spawn system? Would you like to see it changed? What kind of issues are you seeing with it? You know, I'd just love to get some feedback and hear what you guys have to say. But this is going to be where I end it. Hopefully you like this UAV montage. And I'm sorry, you know, I really don't like uploading this type of gameplay. Normally I like to upload better gameplay and I have a little bit more of a standard. But I literally only have six hours on this game. I'm only like a rank 40. Normally I'd be prestiged, maybe one or two prestiges. But I was away in Chicago for my sister's wedding this weekend. And life, like I said in a previous video, has just been kicking my butt. So I haven't had a lot of time to play this game. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put uh, my family and my friends 
and uh, life in front of gaming anytime, you know, priority wise. But uh, I will be playing this more. Hopefully, I can learn these maps a little bit better and get you some more gameplays and some more tips and tricks. But uh, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video anyways. But as always, take care and God bless.